This is a quick video of how to bring in your Roland swatches into Adobe Illustrator. When you have Illustrator open, if you go to Window, scroll down to Swatch Libraries, then you go to Other Library. When Versaworks is installed on your PC, it will automatically store the swatches within your local disk. So we'll go into our hard drive, locate the Versaworks folder, into Swatch, you'll have a cold draw and illustrator. In cold draw, as long as you've got version X7 and above, all the swatches in cold draw will be already built in. But for now, we're using Illustrator, so you double click. And what you have is all the color system libraries that represent each swatch on your printer. So you've got your Roland Versaworks. You select that one, press open, and now you'll see the Roland Versaworks box opens up. So this is your spot colors. This is your cut contour, your perf cut contour, your RDG white and gloss for your UV, also your primer and also your RDG metallic silver. If you want that then to stay there every time you open the software, if you go to your little tab box at the top, press persistent and now every time you open Illustrator that swatch will stay, will open up too. When you go back into your local disk, go back into Swatch, go into Illustrator. All these represent the colours that you have in your machine. So if you've got the latest Truvis, you'll have your green and your orange colour system library. And the main one is the Roland colour system library. This one will represent the printable chart you can do within Versaworks and as you can see they're all colour coded same again press persistent and that will stay in there then every time you open the software